<sighs> okay so good morning good evening everyone and welcome back in today's class today we are on the day number 32 and approximately if i say we are more than 32 our course has been completed it's more than 35 i can say not 32 directly okay today topic is on the cmdb last part <clears throat> so what i know in cmdb we discussed yesterday and day before yesterday ci cmdb creation of ci classes hierarchy cmdb audit perspective compliance correctness three c's values i can say to the topic which we are going to be discuss is little interested the reason is that the reason the reason for the same is that because this is the topic which is widely publicized by service now to their customers because it is a good product they build up now and this concept is called the csdm okay i'll i'll share my screen no problem <clears throat> okay this concept is called the csdm now what do you mean by the word csdm and why this is be required here okay now suppose if you are living in a joint family i am not sure about, about about outside india but india we have a joint family where i am staying my parents my grandparents my my father's brother sister or maybe brothers not sisters are staying together okay in this case if i buy one product in my home then the then the point come that how the product will be managed shall i say that it is my product or shall my parents say that it, it is their product shall my uncle say that it is their product shall my grandparents say it is their product but product is one multiple parties are using that but product is one now if i come into the it terminologies like if you remember that on the day day 5 or day 6 when we discuss about the service now capabilities we saw that how many products service now is delivering itsm is one of the product item is another itbm is another grc is one of them hr is one of them csm is one of them so multiple products are there and every product is using the services now services means let's let's take if the example if i go into the market and i say atul grower is providing a training then training is one of the service which you guys want to be consume it agree on that part if i say okay guys i am providing a services of the bb city then this is a service you guys want to be consume it how this will build how the support will be done in the background you are not bother but in the market this service is available maybe someone says atul i need one to one training someone say i need a group training someone say i need a specific module training so when i say for everyone for the concept is everyone is different someone say group training that is one type of offering i am giving like i told that a lot of people reach out to me can you provide one to one training i said no this is not the service i am offering i am offering only and only the group trainings minimum group should be 3 to 4 people this is the offering i am giving to you now the concept come maybe bumi says atul i am in the csc time zone do you provide the csc time zone trainings as well i said yes i am providing that offering sneha says i am from india can you provide the ic time zone trainings yes i can provide you that part so it is like again service offering in the multiple sections it can be region wise it can be country wise it can be location wise it can be time zone wise as well now this whole concept which we discuss we want to be store into the service now let's take example like Bumi and Ken started his business in the service now, and they says not let's not take the example service now. Let's say that Bumi and Ken started a business of the 
human resource that we are have a con- consultancy which deal in the human resource profiles if anyone need any hr in their company they can reach out to us you need now the question comes so this is the offering they guys are providing in the market so this is a service they are guiding the guys are providing offering now virender is from india reach out to bumi hey i need the trainees hr do you have for india location bumi said yes we have a offering in india as well dipika says do you have a offering in saudi kain said sorry we don't have any offering in saudi it means these are the bifurcations here now what i am going to be show you today's discussion is purely on the pdf format no service now involvement is required here as of now okay because this is a concept i know only this much and then if you read this documents then you can go into the service now and understand that part so now the csdm part, uh, what i can say this is a combination of the two words cs and dm cs stand for the common this is dm stand for the data model that how the services in service now which are common for everyone like like if i take example in the early days actually is a separate department it is a separate department finance is a separate department now as well there are the separate department but hr team is using the services of the it because they also need the laptops they also need the network right finance team using the services of the it it team using the services of the hr to on board of board visa processing immigration part termination on joining off joining sabbatical leave all the things will be there it is a department but they are using the hr services hr using it it using finance finance using marketing marketing using sales it using sales now in all these one they are using the common services so if it is providing the services to the hr and to finance it means the ci or the components are same the offering can be different maybe it team charge to hr 5 dollar per user per week but it is charging from finance 10 dollar per user for the 3 days because they have a lot of confidentiality they don't require that much okay so these things we are going to be discuss in a format now don't be confused i am telling you very clearly try to understand as much as you can and once you understand the basic concepts please write this in your cv or resume as well because if go in the market at least you should know the basic understanding that how the csg model has been defined so csgm has been start in approximately 2017 when service now started this concept okay in the last year 2021 i guess in the rome release they released the csgm 3.0 now in 2022 in the san diego the csgm 4.0 draft is ready it is not published for anyone it is not available for use it is just available in a draft format and at the end of 2022 this will be officially launched in the product so now we are going to be discuss on the 3.0 and little bit on the 4.0 because every new thing in your cv will be addition for you to get a good catch here few another another important point is that this contains a pdf you will get pdf very easily 37 pages this is also a pdf of the 37 pages why i am telling you if you guys read these 37 pages line by line word by word and understand 
then I can say, yeah, that you guys are champ of CSGM. I started this 37 page PDF, maximum eight or 10 page I was able to read it. After that, I give up. Because that is so, so, so confusing. These two things, these two PDF you can download easily. Don't concentrate on 4.0 as of now. Just concentrate on 3.0. Let me go here now. Before that, anyone has any doubt, any question? No, at all. All clear? Yes, sir. Good. Uh, I'm looking for 3.01 bit. Let me add it here. Search with the same words. CSGM 3.0. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I already shared it. I already shared my screen. PDF you can guys download. Just mention CSGM 3.0 white paper. You will get the direct link of the community here. So it is there. Okay. And here is the document available. Now you okay. did you share the screen? I can't see it like uh, so. Is with everyone or only we are facing issue? Maybe. Let me stop sharing and clean it. Share it again. I am able to see. It's visible for me. Let let me do it again. Now we you can confirm. Let's connect to issue from my side. Maybe At because I okay. okay. Oh, no. Now this is the three point zero. Okay. This is the three point zero. And we are only only going to be discussed only 3.0 specifically. Okay, I downloaded this PDF as well. I'm not going to share with you. Just go in the Google and type CAGM 3.0 white paper. You will get it very easily. Nothing to be worried on that part. That's not a case. You will get it very easily. Now come on this part. A standard and shared set of service related definition across our products and the platform. So why CSGM come into the picture? Because now every department is providing a service to, the, to the, any other department. So they are the standard and the shared services. And how to store that in a framework, they bring up the data model. This is the definition of the CSGM. Number one point. Second point, which is important to understand. This is this is a good read here. This one. It is not a product or neither a configuration file. It is not like you just double click and setup has been done. No, it is a matter of tables that how tables are defined and in which table you need to be store your data. Okay. Okay. So this is the one thing. So it is CSGM is not a process. No, it is not a set of reports. No, it is not a code to install. No, or it is not a automatic fix of the previous implementation. No, it is a framework you can see here. And on the basis of the framework, you can build your model. So don't be confused. Don't say in the interview, hey, CSGM is a kind of a product. No, it is a framework to make sure that all the services which you are, which you are sharing with anyone else or a standard services we are providing to the customer is a, that part. So let's take an example. If I, if I go here, for example, quickly. I'm running a company X. Okay. Company X is a portfolio that we deal in the human resource. We deal in the IT and we deal in the BPO. Okay. Are the three services they are providing. Now under that in HR, they have an offering like 
एच आर इन कॉलेज एच आर इन स्टार्टअप आई टी डेवलपमेंट एंड सपोर्ट ओके बीपीओ नेशनल नेशनल एंड रीजनल दे आर देर ऑफरिंग्स these are their offerings in the later on i'll show you that one one sample of cj model that nahi ho rahi give give me a minute guys i i'll be just will back in a minute my wife is calling me in downstairs i'll be on the mute for a minute okay <clears throat> okay i'm back guys sorry okay so these are the service offering for the same now if i come to the cgm part here uh, i'll start from here mainly so that you guys can understand the concepts here now this thing this is the basic fundamental of csgm 3.0 okay let me enlarge this uh, here it is <clears throat> hmm. so now what service now says here that this is your portfolio this one means this three is your portfolio right now on the portfolio i have a four separate sections for you 
so that you should know that what are the services you are be carrying so the concept which we discussed yesterday on the cmdb part it is here this is a cis cmdb is top on the cmdb sorry csdm is on the top of the cmdb we are going to be build up so what they says they says that i have categorize your data or or your your way of storing the things in a four section foundation design technical services sell and consume let's start from sell and consume this one number fourth section here <clears throat> this one what do you mean by the word sell and consume sell and consume says that what you are selling to your customers is basically sell or consume means what they can consume like like this so suppose if you want to order something from amazon right you consume it or amazon sell out to you guys and how you do you go to the catalog or the website and from there you get a order i want to take amazon web services for the saudi region i go to the portal will find out the saudi region and then from where i will select it so in the sell and consume you are selling the business services to the consumer this particular area green is specifically for only and only for the consumers customers i can say these four things has a meaning here very carefully this is this is a thing that csd model has been going to be and i can say not going it's popular nowadays because this has a good bifurcation on the place what is this service portfolio let me scroll down here service portfolio says it is it is pure english and we are going to be discuss that only before that anyone has any doubt any question in their mind till this point you are getting it not getting it atul it's going to be tough not understanding do you think anything do you think that something is not working for you in this in this particular session that is okay so far so good try good. to again yes i am saying that it is this csm is more than in development it is a concept to understand so what portfolio says it is a hierarchical classification of business services that define the strategic business value and facilitate the management to their life cycle to their life cycle means this particular portfolio the okay what is the portfolio of atul grover i am a consultant i am a trainer i am a guest speaker i am a drummer i am a baker as well this is my portfolio because via this portfolio i am getting a business value which helping me to manage my life cycle completely it can be product it can be service like training is a service but baking a cake is a product so that is called the hierarchical classification like if i if i change this into the hierarchical format hr like this hr it and b2 and on the top i mention here x portfolio then it become hierarchical for me in the hr i have a different different steps here let me show you one example here mm health care example let's try to do this part so like this here you can come mm. 
like this okay so let's take example this is a hospital and whose portfolio is imaging maybe i can say scanning as well in the scanning they have a category called the mri ठीक है सो दीज टू आर द पोर्टफोलियो मेनली द पोर्टफोलियो इज दिस इन दिस पोर्टफोलियो आई हैव अ कैटेगरी कॉल्ड एमआरआई आई हैव अ कैटेगरी कॉल्ड अल्ट्रासाउंड आई हैव अ कैटेगरी कॉल्ड एक्सरेस ऑल द थिंग्स विल बी देयर देन इट इज अ सर्विस इट इज अ बिजनेस सर्विस आई कैन से रजिस्ट्रेशन इज माय बिजनेस सर्विस लेट लेट मी लेट मी पिक अप समथिंग मोर फॉर द एक्चुअल पार्ट दैट विल बी इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड एक्चुअली 365 let me pick up this our service now client hardware this cannot be going up <coughs> it's going to be the same one health care hmm. this one we let's see this one okay this is a good example actually yeah hmm. this is the example of the office 365 okay they are not using the portfolio on the top because microsoft has a lot of offerings they have office 65 they have web services they have what i can what i can say other than that um there are different products available their servers are available on the market so that is their portfolio so if you want to see here just to be clarify this one so after portfolio we have a service offering so let me come back to this point only हाँ दिस वन अरे नहीं कहाँ गया वो स्क्रीन शॉट हमारा सो मेनी टैब्स भी ओपन ओह ओके दिस वन ओके सो नाउ दिस इज माय सर्विस पोर्टफोलियो नाउ व्हाट इज द बिजनेस सर्विस दिस सेस दिस वन दिस सेस पब्लिश टू अ बिजनेस यूजर underpin one or more business capabilities so like if anything which a consumer can order is a business service for me so like if i go here this one so microsoft says that you can purchase office 365 for me that is a business service i am giving to you this is my business service i am giving to you because you are going to be consume office 365 o365 completely okay don't be confused now office 60 o365 is a complete product which you as a company can order and microsoft selling it as a business service because they have a portfolio for the same okay now if i go down here Are tell me where I this one? Uh huh. Oh, this one. Now come here. This one. Okay. Business service offering. Business service offering says that when you divide your business service in multiple categories, like location wise, pricing wise, availability wise, capability wise, critical wise, business approval wise. let's say if in a batch i have more than 10 students the fees will be this much that is one offering if in a batch i will get 50 students the fees will be this if i am teaching to the us student the fees will be this if you want to get a one to one training then fees will be this it's called the availability 
so in this example okay remember this one is there right i go to this one comes here so now in this office 65 office project and this sky are the service offering maybe my company says i want to just use a 65 not these two offering hai na depend karta hai it's it's totally depend what type of offer you want to get it let's say if you want to buy a new car you get a offer if you book a car today you will get 10% discount if you book the two cars together you will get the all accessories free of cost if you book one car today and give a 50% down payment then you will get 3 months or 3 years more warranty and servicing free that is the offering which is available this is a offering and and it is depend on the business what type of offering they want to purchase now after this if i come here we have a request catalog request catalog we already discuss where a customer go and see the offering and order it clear everyone till this point any doubt any question anyone let me come back here bikola sara kachi dipika anupur bhumi didona no laura all clear everyone any doubt any question i'm processing good detona laura sneha abhi kunal what about you guys yeah good i'm here okay good now let's go to the next step when we have a offering for customer then we have to maintain the data as well foundation data foundation data we all know user group location departments company contracts cmdb models groups all this become my foundation data i am not going to the depth because we already know a lot of things here cmdb group means what are the groups supporting to which of the services like if i am facing some issue in the baking i can reach out to my wife for the support she is my support group either i bake a cake a bread a brownie a cupcakes anything i bake so she is my one of the group who help me to take care of my services this concept is good if you are in a pure 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 technical part i will say because this is used to build your queries and i'll not go in the depth because otherwise we all get confused product models which we discussed yesterday it's a hardware software in the hardware what type of product i have server computer all these things will be there contracts like you and me have a contract 40 hours training this much amount one day one hour every day if you leave the class in between you have to pay the full amount next time all the things will be a contract and common data we started the journey from this only user group location department all the things will be there but this is not for the customer this is for the internal purpose to run this particular thing you need these things on the place okay then after that the third step come is called the design a very 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 important if you want to start a business just give me a minute i guess someone at the door Yeah. So, so the point is that when we are discussing the designing part, see, suppose if I want to start a business, 
before i send or before i print out the pamphlets or or kind of a advertisement boards i need this thing that where i'm going to be open who is the person who is going to be work with me all the things will be there i need to be designed that and in this area i have a two new topics business capability and the business application business capability and the business application and what is that actually it is here business capability is a high level capability required by the organization to execute its business model if i want to provide you services as a service now training services then i should have a capability so that i can execute my business model let's say if i want to grow this training area my recommend my point is that i want more and more business okay in in market my portfolio is there that atul grower is a trainer available but do we do i have a capability to do that part and to do the capability i need to be learn more and more actually only then i can build my capability business application a purchase or internally developed application used to support a business capability now if i say here the presentation you are seeing the presentations you are getting the knowledge you are getting the examples you are getting it is a it internally develop to prove my capability if let let's example if tomorrow i open a website and say okay guys let's read this you say atul what type of trainer you are english reading we can do at home as well so to do that part i have to do the business application here okay and we will discuss this this two points from the example as well and finally information objects the information that basically the knowledge which i am giving to you here is called my information objects specifically that only but in this area these two terms are important for the understanding perspective let come back here this one now these are the service offering right on the side they have a business application and what business application they have office 65 office project and skype i am telling you with my experience and this is a disclaimer i want to put it here this is completely my experience my knowledge sometime you notice that the service offering and the business application is the same these are the logical actually if it is not physical it will be logical only okay now if i if i go here for the other part where it's gone not this one uh where is the healthcare gone where is that gone healthcare one okay this one so now what is the business capability they have let's see business application emr is their business application here so and on the top they have the business capability called the patient management is business capability see if in a hospital any patient is coming we need to maintain their data as well to do that part i have a patient management medication management these things i am not offering to anyone as of now this is just to prove my capability internally if a customer want only then i will offer it otherwise i will not offer it i I'll, i'll charge for this then in the this part i have a business application my chart outpatient or inpatient so so it is little little tough to understand at point of time that what do you mean by the business sorry okay what do you mean by the business capability or business application here 
सो समथिंग विच यू आर यूजिंग फॉर द इंटरनल पर्पज दट इज फॉर द बिजनेस एप्लीकेशन इन आउट इन एंड आउट इज अ एप्लीकेशन ऑन द टॉप वी हैव अ पेशेंट मैनेजमेंट इज अ कैपेबिलिटी है इफ माई सर्वस माई कस्टमर सेज आई वॉन्ट फॉर द ऑफरिंग ऑफ द इन पेशेंट आई सेट ओके देन आई विल गिव ओनली दिस मच पोर्शन दिस मच बिकॉज अदरवाइज ही विल नॉट एबल टू यूज माई सर्विसेस क्लियर टिल दिस पॉइंट एवरी वन एनी डाउट लेट मी कम बैक हियर सरान रूपोर दीपिका भूमि केन कुनाल अभी हेज बिन ड्रॉप डाउट कैची स्नेहा लॉरा गुड टू गो राइट ओके गेट नाउ आई कम टू द लास्ट पार्ट ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर थिंग दैट इज कॉल्ड द मैनेज टेक्निकल सर्विसेस for this the best example i can say you guys and including me we are attending the trainings now who is supporting us in the background our spouse maybe housemates maybe my mother my father my kid my wife they are supporting us so what this says that this is the place we are actually thing has been happening and they have a added a concept called the application service if anything goes wrong in your house you will not raise the incident on the house you will raise the incident on that particular service let's say example i am providing you the training as a service if you discuss offline maybe on the mobile phone or the whatsapp i can tell you something and task will be over but if i am in this forum on the live session if i am telling you something wrong you will raise a question atul your point is not valid this is called the application service which is actually used by customer to raise a incident or a change or a problem so in this concept see this is this particular area is a completely background customer never know who is supporting me in the background okay so in this what we have we have a application service we have a technical service and technical service offering and we have a dynamic ci group a very very big what i can say a a very 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 big game changer in the upcoming time this concept is purely technical i never try to use that part but i have a little understanding which we discuss now okay now if i come here just to show you that example then it is easy for us to be go now in the business offering i have a application in the office i have a word excel powerpoint in the projects i have a projects in the skype i have a skype if my skype is not working where you will raise the incident will you raise the incident on this this area you raise the incident on this area or you raise the incident on this area tell me if your skype is not working in which area you will raise a incident business service service offering application service business application tell me in which area will raise it tell me guys speak please please speak okay what is the what is the purpose of ac to give a cool air agree everyone let let me come back here 
yes right so what type of service it's providing it is providing the cool air as a service to me now if my ac is not working you will raise the incident to the mechanic and what you say that i am not getting the cool air then he will put a question that from which component from which device from which equipment you are not getting the cool air it is a ac it is a cooler it is a fridge it is something x y z then you say i am facing the issue on the ac as a service which i bought from you so whenever any incident need to be raised it will be raised only on the application service this is the service you are using you are not using the o65 skype you are using the skype as a software like this you are using this skype you are not using the complete microsoft no so on these area this is called the application service on these area you are going to be raise your incident clear till this point everyone any doubt any question now if i have a application here and in the background i have a component these are the cis that this skype is running on which server this project is running on which server this part to be running on which server that is a ci part now if i have a raise a issue on the skype like like if you remember that we discussed this point during monday to friday if you call me between 9 to 9 i will reply to you fine but bikula is a concern atul your 9 in the morning is a midnight for me i cannot call you that time i said okay if you want to connect me that time then i will charge extra money because i have to put a separate support there that is become a technical services here technical service and offering offering on the basis of the region offering on the basis of the location offering on the basis of the payments offering on the basis of the skill set a lot of things are there now i come back to this particular area this one and let's discuss technical service published to the service owner typically underpin one or more business service means this technical service is helping one or, or more the business service here to support this we have a technical service now customer say your hr service is not working properly can i see the hr services no i'll go back and check that which server it has been deployed is not working that is called the technical here technical service offering which we discuss in the business service offering the same concepts application service is a logical representation see skype you cannot touch this skype you cannot touch you can see you can use but you cannot touch it means it is a logical service for me on which i am going to be raise a incident and dynamic ci group says a grouping of configuration item based on the different different results of the cmdb query i want to trigger a approval to the user where the cmdb or the ci type is business services and the group assigned to xyz so these are the called the query builder here okay understand everyone till this point let me come back here now go for the question answer guys so we have a these many supports here it's good 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 no actually is a new concept to me so i'm not i'm still trying to understand it it is not only a new concept for you even it is new concept for me as well yeah okay it is still in the developing stage i i tell you very very a thing very clearly 
the model you are seeing here, it's got this one. I did not find at least in the last one or two years till this, this uh, I guess in the one year, I did not find a single organization. Again, it is my experience. Who is using the CSGM completely given by service now? Who has a capability, who has application, who has all these things, all these things will be there. The model you're seeing here, it is a very, 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 very idle model. To bring, to build this model, you have a strong data in your system, strong relationship between all this data. Only then this model will become, it's coming to the picture. Companies are using, no doubt. But few companies are using, but companies are using as per their requirement. Someone says, I don't have a capability of the application. They're not using this section. They say, I want to one, two, and three. Someone say one and two will be okay. This three is just one service will be okay. But as I'll taking care of this point here only. So for, for everyone in the call, including me, it is important for us to be understand this particular concept. If you read this paper, 37 or 31 pages paper, you will came to know a lot of good things about this. It is a good area where you can, you can do your hands on part. It is 4.0. It is 3.0. Now you can see. What is service? What is application technical service? If you read this, then you will be able to know this point. I tried reading this, but after some time I give up. So a lot of things are there now. Common data, not the configuration items. Don't think that user is a configuration. No, it is a foundation data. Okay. Now just on the top of that, I'm bringing one more thing for you. Let, let me see one example here and to an example, healthcare system. So what they have in the healthcare system, this one. So they says that I have an application service called the Epic production. And for this, they have an application service called the Epic. Both are the same because application service. To support this, they have a technical services. If you want to teach that how the MRI work to your trainees doctor, it is called the non-production. But if you are doing the MRI of the live patient, that is a production system. Okay, so, so the only point which I can be tell here today, read about this picture and try to understand this kind of a concepts that how this has been built up. So like they have a service now platform that how service now they say let's discuss about the service now only client computer hardware that how it has been designed so read about these blogs these concepts you will come to know a lot of things but master is only one that is here this pdf it is a master for everyone read this and check the examples Okay. Everyone clear till this point? Any doubt? Any question? So it's a Epic is an application. My chart is an application. These things. So that you should understand that how these things are working this year. Okay. Clear everyone till this point. Any doubt, any question? Yes, guys, any doubt, any question? No okay. Now let's move to the last topic and that is called the CSGM 4.0. What's new in 4.0? We'll see here. Absolutely, we don't understand 3.0. How can we understand 4.0? Okay, the, the reason is that why I'm putting 4.0 because the time you complete this training and new product will be launched or the new version of the service now will launch, they are going to use a 4.0. Oh. There's a no major difference they put. 
but what they added just just a few things I, even i had not complete idea there but when i was going to the on uh, sorry overview perspective then i found that number one they introduce a build phase here in 3.0 they have a sorry this is 4.0 right okay good little bigger one so in 3.0 uh, it's called, they have a design design foundation cell but in 4.0 they have build design and cell and they bring the foundation at the bottom why they bring the site at the bottom they say that to do any kind of this work you need the foundation here you need the foundation here earlier what happened they said okay let's do one thing let's put the foundation here only and do the linking part then the question come what about the foundation of this one what group i should mention here what group i should mention here what group i should mention here then service now says let's make it as a base for everyone and they bring this foundation at the baseline for everyone now these sections will be applicable for the all four boxes here no other changes they remove foundation from here to here and they added a build phase now what do you mean by the build phase here let me open this one clgm 4.0 this one okay what this says what they added here is uh, Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait! What they added here? I was going through that part. Ah, uh, give me a minute. I let me check. I was reading some document. Yeah, this one. Okay. Revolution. This. 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 Wait. Okay. this one is the build phase let let me open oh, it's con sorry see they did not give any kind of a definition of the build phase here very bad uh, build is a new domain here so what they done in the 4.0 they bring the build as a new domain here and they expanded foundation data and the cell and consume area for us if someone asked that what is the major difference in 3.0 and the 4.0 then you can say in 3.0 we have a build phase as well okay now i'll go here for the build part see the reason they are saying it's a draft because the definitions are still pending but we as a human being are always eager to know about more and more detail description physical mock ups this i'm just chm domain foundation they bring it here that's fine business process contracts that's fine group we discuss already then hardware life cycles logical common data location they added new design this one build so what do you mean by the word build domain here and why service now introduce this this as a concept here service now says that okay build is the term which come from the devops my developer is doing a development and they are doing the check in of their codes and the develop deployment team or the devops team doing the deployment for the same 
So they says build a CSGM domain that represent the table utilized to give visibility in the build effort, but not limited to the DevOps only. Okay, I'll, I'll not go much in depth. I'm sure that you will be confused. Just understand one thing that build domain has been introduced for the DevOps perspective to make sure to use that if I'm making a change in a in a in a table level somewhere that how much efforts is be required and that includes the sglc component my application and my infra it is not for the end user it is completely for the deployment team okay rest no changes are there as of now so what you have to be do now Go through and read about this CSGM 3.0. And if you get a chance, read about this 4.0 up to this part only. Only this part. Nothing much. Okay, clear everyone. Let me come back here. Oh. Yes, guys. Sneha, Lara, Titona, Kunal, Kachi. Pigola, Kane, Bumi, Deepika. Okay. <laughs> actually, it actually it is very very interesting topic. And and you will not believe, I have a lot of hot discussion just on the components only. My customers say it is a service. Or it is a business service. I said how it is a business service. It is an application service. So being a consultant, you should be very clear on the terms that what is the definition of an application service. Only then you can help a customer to bring their data in the respective category or not, a table or not. Okay. So we'll not go much on that now. This is what I want to be. Uh, I want to be share with you before I close the recording. Anyone has any last question to be asked here? Not me. Okay, Kane, Newport, Deepika, Bumi, Bigola, Kachi, Sara. I'm okay. Okay, good. Let me stop the recording here then and take a quick attendance. <laughs>